engineers trained. So how many engineers have you successfully put through some kind of a training program, whether it's an official certification program by the different cloud providers, all the major cloud providers will offer a training program. So whether it's AWS or Azure or Google or Oracle or IBM, the hyperscalers will all have a certification track. Have you put those engineers through this certification training? That's a really good key performance indicator. Another one would be to assess or to inventory the number of engineers that have done cloud migration projects before or that have experience with cloud migration projects. That becomes a really good key performance indicator. As part of this training, your engineers are also going to to undergo a mindset change. So to do things differently than the way that we've been doing them on premises. If you have engineers that are going to try to implement everything they know, everything they've been doing on premises, on the cloud, then I can almost guarantee there'll be no cost savings, no optimization, and in most likelihood, these cloud projects will fail. So what we wanna do is start to build their knowledge. So the certification becomes a really good foundation. After that, we wanna put them through a series of exercises, hands-on exercises, so that they can continue to expand their experience with these different cloud providers. That, in turn, turns into a really good key performance indicator.